<clears throat> Hello everyone, hope you're doing well. Uh, we are in the strike still for those of you that are in the acting uh, industry or those of you who are affected by that. They always try to say, what about the cleaners? Uh, it's always the cleaners, but there's also people that provide food, there's craft services, people that bring food to the um, to the set, those who cook there. Um, there's people that work in wardrobe, that make wardrobe repairs. Um, so there's a lot of people that are not necessarily directly hired by the studios or working on an actual production. Uh, it could be anything from, the, you know, there's a gas station, you know, <clears throat> across the street from a location. I know when I film up like an, an act or whatever, uh, a lot of those areas is very, very uh, remote. Uh, and sometimes there'll be a, um, uh, a little convenience store at a gas station. And if you want to get something before or after work or you're on your way home, or you need to top off your tank and get a little more gas uh, in your car. Um, get a snack for the road for the drive home it's about 85 miles 85 minutes or so usually for me depending on traffic to get up into the the high desert the desert areas there uh, chloe's head is right there she's peeking hi chloe three piece here too oh, oh, oh. Oh, you're so heavy i gotta she's so heavy i gotta bend my knees oh yeah hi hey there okay go ahead Dan. your turn chloe, oh, uh, chloe. Yeah, hello. Oh, she could. People always ask about her eyes. No, it's not cataracts. Um, and she's fine. She sees okay. As you can see. She can see. Okay, that's Chloe and that's uh, Sweetie Pea. But anyway, back to what I was talking about is um, a lot of people have been affected. I've been affected, of course. Uh, you know, I was in the Screen Actors Guild. We're on strike. Then the writers were on strike. And I, I'm not sure if they did this. Or, uh, it seems like they did. They maybe knowing that a strike might happen i'm sure maybe a lot of scripts were were rushed or or, or uh, stored uh, in case of a strike uh, the writer strike of course they struck i think back in was it 2008 was it 2008 their last strike sag uh, after i think this is the last time we were on strike at the same time the writers were it was 1980 that was the year i graduated from high school and i was uh, not doing acting then <laughs> maybe acting up you know how it is when you're a kid but anyway, so just covering a, a little bit on that. Um, uh, what's going on with you? I hope you are all doing well. I think I'm going to do another video tonight. It's been requested quite a bit. Um, people always ask me. Um, oh, Chloe just stole Sweetie Pea's treat. Um, <laughs> so, Sweetie Pea, you got to eat faster. Chloe's naughty, and we've always blamed Sweetie Pea for not eating faster. She's so tiny. Uh, <clears throat> so, the last time they were on strike was 1980. So, I think I'll do a second video. Uh, which will be uh, about the American plan, uh, the American, uh, yeah, uh, it, it, it maybe call it the American plan, what we do in America, maybe in Europe, I don't know, other areas, when it comes to weight loss, uh, exercise, and health. Um, everyone always tells me, just just tell me what to do. Just give me a couple of things I can do. Well, first of all, like I said in the very beginning, this channel is about what I did, what I do, how I maintain. If I say I put a little weight, what am I going to do to to maybe take some of the weight off. Um, what kind of exercises I do? It's a really hot outside. I've been doing a little uh, pool walking. A lot of people say, what do you do in the pool? Do you swim, swim, swim? And, and, and yes, yeah, sometimes. But sometimes I just will, will walk and have a walking thing. I, mean, I can tell you guys a little about that later too. But this will be about the American plan. What we say, hey, you know, doctors say you're overweight. You know, hey, you, 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 you. Your doctor will tell you, you're fat or you're heavy. You need to lose a little weight. Depends on the doctor you have. When I was in the military, of course, it's, hey, fat boy. You need to lose some weight. But um, most doctors look have a little bit better bedside manner than that nowadays. Uh, or in the uh, maybe in the, in the uh, civilian sector. Um, but but what do we do? What do we do? So I can't really give you two things. Because like, give me, just give me two, maybe three things, what I can do. Uh, you basically know what, they get, what, I'm gonna, what I would say. So what I'm saying is that you um, have to talk to your doctor. You have to talk to your pharmacist. You have to talk to your nutritionist. You physical therapy, a physical, you know, maybe someone that could put you in a plan, a physical personal trainer, kind of thing, maybe not personalize them to one person, but maybe as a group, and you want to join a group exercising thing. They have a lot of those in the military, I mean, in the, in the, the VA. Uh, they uh, um, have a program at the VA called the MOVE program. I went to one meeting they asked me to go to, and I was at my heaviest, and I didn't really need that. They would sit in a chair and they would grab a can of peas and a can of uh, cream corn, or whatever, <laughs> and spin their arms. And I didn't really need that. I, I could spin my arms. I was strong. I was fat, but I was strong. 
and I was able to walk and, and that's uh, was basically the key was getting moving and, and changing what I did and I will go over that tonight maybe make a 10-15 minute video on that on just what people keep asking me over and over again I get asked that question a lot Another question I can ask is, how can you help? How can you help my channel? Well, one, there's a couple of things you can do. Number one, you can, you can, if you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe. Please share the videos. Please watch the videos. And if you want to make a donation, you're welcome to do so. There's a, a, a on my channel, you can see it. There's a Patron, or whatever you call it, a Patron thing. There's a thing for PayPal and a couple others. And when you, if you watch a short, sometimes there's a little um, thanks button. I can't remember they call them, super thanks. So that, and, and there should be one on here too. If you click that, you want to, throw a buck on there or two bucks whatever you want to do if you want to do that if you don't want to do that don't do that so like i said i can't tell you what to do I cannot and i will not tell you what to do and i will not tell you if i try if i do try anything that i think might be a little dangerous i'll even tell you about that like when i did the uh last november which was about six seven months ago now uh maybe eight going to, yeah my channel was started in august so this channel is almost one years old we have over twelve thousand subscribers you need to have a thousand subscribers in order to become monetized so we're like they call it like times monetized so right now i'm at 12.5 times monetized i think that's what they say um, i don't know who, who knows what that but it is monetized does it make any money no <laughs> doesn't make any money uh, i don't have any sponsors yet um some people have approached me about sponsoring loans about a, a, a bike to try um and if they want if they could get back in contact with me maybe i can do that so a couple of them have uh medic medications so i won't do that um, unless I unless I do try and it works, you know, I talk to my doctor, my pharmacist, etc. And if it works, I mean, I'll let you know. Uh, and I have been approached by a couple of the uh, some uh, meal replacement uh, types of thing, and I have to try it. A lot of times they don't want you to try it. They say, "Hey, we want you to do it. just shoot a quick video, talk about how great this tastes, and um, and how you've been using it, and whatever." I can't really do that. That wouldn't be. I mean, first of all, things that taste great could be good for you. They could be bad for you. So. Uh, uh, there's a lot of things that taste great that I just can't uh, really do. So if I was basing my uh, testimonial on what tastes great, you know, I, I like that well, um, pralines and cream ice cream at uh, Baskin Robbins. Uh, you know, I like chocolate fudge ice cream. I love cookies. I'm a bread eater. I love bread. I eat a lot of bread. So I'll go to a restaurant and that's okay, I'm not going to eat bread. So there's a place that give you all you can eat bread. Like, hey, can we bring you a bread basket? And, you know, you're paying for the meal and you say, oh, no, no bread. For me, thank you. I'll just have salad with no croutons. Um, you're paying for that. So if you go out to eat and, and, and that and that's an option, it's hard to say no to that. And you can eat a lot of bread, a lot of bread with butter. Hopefully, no no margarine, but a lot of bread, a lot of butter, and all that stuff, which is um, which is okay if you don't eat too much and you don't do it too often. But uh, I said you, I meant me. If I don't do it too often and I don't eat too much when I'm sitting down, if I don't do it too often, then sometimes you won't eat a lot. Maybe you won't eat some you know, spaghetti and have a couple of breadsticks. I don't know. But um, yeah, it's, it's part of the thing. So I think I'll, I will try to shoot that video tonight. Tonight is Friday, the 28th of July. I think I started my channel halfway through August, so I'm about a half month away. Uh, or so from be one year so it's been very successful a lot of people that will start a uh, channel and they can't get monetized for years i talked to someone that has a channel and i think he he says he has 680 subscribers and he doesn't have enough to get it and, and if i watch a channel like it maybe i'll shoot a little video for him and say hey take a look at his and maybe he'll do okay i don't know but mine uh, got monetized very fast i have a lot of watch hours i, I think it's like fifty thousand watch hours um and some of my videos have you know been watched uh, 10,000 times some when they first come out will hit a thousand real quick and then nothing then all of a sudden someone starts watching it uh, some of the ones they like to watch it like right now I shot that one about my residual checks um, months ago um, and people watch that one all the time uh, oh yeah here it is thank God it's Friday I put that out on May 5th May 5th and someone is watching it right now so you never know you put them out there you sit out there and someone says I'd like to be an actor I wonder how it works and they see that I put that thing about residual checks and they do that so anyway I'm going to upload this video I'm going to first of all I'm going to upload it and then I'm going to download it and then I'm going to send, put it on YouTube so right now I'm shooting this on my regular phone not on the YouTube short because it's long it's 9.9 minutes and 33 seconds right now everybody have a great day it's Friday thank God it's Friday have a great weekend stay safe if, if you're in this area of Southern California or Arizona or Nevada, whatever, I, we're having a huge heat wave, and I think they're having a heat wave basically across the country. There are some fires, so be careful with fire. Let's not have any more fires because it's so hot and so 
so dry right now and we had all that rain which is great we love the rain but with all that rain there's a lot of trees out there then with a lot of there's been a lot of growth when it's really when it's really really um rainy and snowing out here so now that those trees have grown if they don't get enough water now they're going to die and it'll get really brown and, and, and dry and there was fire so be careful be careful out there have a great weekend hope everybody's doing great talk to you later